when I'm working on my crochet garments, I like to work in one piece as much as possible. So today I'm going to show you how you can work your ribbing and your body in one piece. Keep watching. So to achieve the ribbing, we'll be using two size crochet hook, a larger one and a smaller one. I'm using a five and a four. So I'm going to grab the five or the larger one in your case and make that foundation chain. Make that chain as long as you want your top to be or crochet garment to be. And then you're going to place a stitch marker in where you want that ribbing to happen. Then you're going to work that row using your larger hook your way down to that stitch marker. Once you get to that stitch marker, you want to switch to a smaller one and work your ribbing. The ribbing can be a single crochet, a slip stitch or the same um, stitch you're using, just using that smaller hook. At the end, you're going to chain one turn and only work in the back loops. After you've worked the number of rows that you left, you want to replace that stitch marker and continue with your larger hook and repeat that and there you go.